you know, it's not our fault that we're uh, like behind in the yeah. tracks because of the of history and like how Wait, yeah, things yeah. have excelled. But it's our fucking it's our it's our job. It's that our we're job here to to do our best that we can to yeah. change our circumstances. So it's not it's not your fault. It's not literally not your fault that you're given the the situation that you're given. But it is your fucking obligation to. Do something I, about it. There's no such thing as obligation. I no 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 no. I, I truly think like you listen. You can't complain about something that you you can't you can't fix. All right, all right. Since we're since I got two things. This is gonna combine two things we were talking about. You're talking about obligation here, right? I feel we shouldn't be obligated to do anything. So I feel for me personally with this quarantine shit. Now we're since we're talking about Corona and now we were talking about obligation, right? With this corona shit, I have a lot of free time. I'm home all day. I got nothing better to do, but I, f I feel at least I got nothing better to do than focus on myself, build and understand who I truly am, right? Okay. So I've been sitting, I've been reading a lot. I've been writing a lot. Okay. I've been watching a lot of videos on like philosophy and shit like that. Okay. I've been, but I've also been taking my time and enjoying myself, watching TV, playing some video games and shit like that. I've been playing Smash like crazy. I've been playing COD like crazy. Like, you know, I, and, I feel there's that like you could definitely see a difference between people who who are want to do something for themselves and people that are maybe not don't care about that shit that much. They don't care about growing and and whatever, which I feel is not a bad thing. You're not obligated to do shit. If you don't want to grow and become a millionaire, you don't got to do that shit. Be who you want to be. Mm. So, Makes for, sense. An, for I'm going to give you an example right now. Being home, what do you think is the best thing for you to be doing? Staying home. Being at home, what are you gonna be doing? Oh, you're asking me like personally? Yeah. What are you? Th yeah. Um, I mean, I personally think for like, for anybody, we're talking about in general. Oh, anybody? Uh, grow. I, I say grow as a grow, person. Okay. Bro. So, do you think it's bad to watch, sit there, and watch Netflix all day? I mean, no, because I do Why, that sometimes. You, you, sound you sound hesitant, bro. Because all right. So, so if I sat there. And we're on quarantine for three months, right? Mm -hmm. And all, every single day of those three months, all I did was watch Netflix. Did I waste my time? I mean, I have many, I have many like different, like, so my mind's split right now. So let me explain. So like in my head, I'm thinking like, all right, um, you know, if I'm thinking like, if I don't come out of this quarantine, like with something new or like growing, uh, if I haven't grown as a person or something, mm. then I, um, then I feel like I've slacked personally. Yeah. But as, as. Like, if you watch every fucking Netflix show and you're content with that, like you're happy with that, okay. then that's good for you. You yeah. know what I mean? But personally, that just wouldn't be for me because I, I'm not going to say it's a waste of time, but it's 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 leisure time. It's So there's no obligation to do something better for you? No, but but what I'm saying is... Oh. Okay, okay, but this is what I was saying, Jason. I understand. <laughs> no, 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 no. I understand what you're saying, but I think, I think like... Well, Smith says this, bro. He says... Okay, it's not your fault. Like I was saying, it's not your fault that you're in the situation you're in, right? It's not our fault that we're not. we're born not. in in urban neighborhoods. I, or legit, whatever. I didn't even choose to be born, bro. I'm just here. Yeah, you know I what I mean. Like, and and um, it's not it's not our fault, bro. Literally, we're given the cards that we're dealt with, like poker, bro. You're given the cards that you're dealt with, and you you play your fucking hand True. for the game. True. And I just think like, don't. This is what I was trying to get at. Don't complain about your life if you're not changing it if you're not trying to fucking change it if you're literally like but we're human beings bro. i know but no matter okay what. but all i'm saying is if if you're gonna all right it's your choice i don't care i don't honestly like truth i, I mean that in, i do all, care not, i care i mean that in, doesn't care no no no, care. no 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 shut up i mean that in good heart <laughs> like i mean that like i truly don't care what you do like i'll, I'll love you no matter what you know what i mean like i tell i told jason that all the time true like whatever you like whatever you decide to do bro i I'll fucking love you no matter what. You're my fucking brother. You know what I mean? Mm. Like, I'm, I'm going to support you no matter what. I'm going to tell you what I think. But I'm never going to tell you what to do. You know? That's just how I am. And if you want to watch Netflix all fucking this shit last six months, you want to watch Netflix all day, watch every fucking show, and, and you want to be content with that, fucking be content with that. Do it. Fucking, you're not do obligated to do shit. Happy, bro. Yeah, do whatever makes you fucking happy. But all I'm saying is, don't fucking come because all right. So I'm speaking on a personal level. So don't fucking complain about something if you're not gonna, gonna change. Yeah, okay. So because all right. So see, that's the way you should say it, bro. Yeah. So don't complain about. So like, okay, it's your choice, whatever. But don't complain about it. So I'm talking about. So just to get like a little personal, 
uh, a big reason why I started, like we started this podcast, right? And why I wanted to do this podcast so much was because I talk so much fucking shit. You know, I talk, I'm fucking great at talking shit. I was legit like, yo, I'm going to start a podcast. I'm going to start a podcast. I said that shit 2016 when I was a fucking senior in high school. You know what I mean? I said that to myself. I'm going to start a podcast. I fucking like this shit. I really want to do it. And it took us, what, th- three years, four years to fucking do it? I mean, you didn't, I didn't know you wanted to do a podcast. You didn't ask me until last year. Yeah, yeah, so last year. But what I mean is, like, it took that long. Yeah. So I was, I was always consistently talking shit and not doing stuff about it. Yeah. And I, and I was consistently just, just, I was, I was a sayer, bro. I wasn't a doer. I was saying, oh, I'm going to do this. I'm going to change the world. I'm going to do that. You know what I mean? But I wasn't doing fucking shit. Mm. So I truly, you know, I was bitching and complaining about, something I wanted or something I, I thought I deserved, but I wasn't putting in the fucking work to fucking get it or I wasn't trying to change. You know what I mean? I was staying stagnant and being who I was then and now I've realized that. So that's that's where I'm coming from in a perspective. I'm not saying like, don't fucking watch Netflix because it's fucking, you know, it's fucking melting your brain. Blah, blah, blah. I don't care. I watch fucking Netflix all the time. I'm watching Gotham right now. Fucking crazy ass show.